Now to our local breaking news alert in the Woodland Acres area of Arlington, where the state fire marshal is looking into the cause of a fire that sent a man and a child to the hospital. Within the last hour, we've learned the two jumped out of a second story window to escape the flames at the Golden Shores Apartments. News for Jack's reporter Eric Avignon is joining us live from the scene where fire crews have left, but investigators are still there at work, Eric. Yeah, and I just got some brand new information just coming in. The dad uh, who jumped out of that window has just arrived here. He just told me, I'm saying this was within like the last 45 seconds, just told me that uh, he's okay, but that his three-year-old son uh, had to be taken to a hospital in Gainesville to be treated for his injuries. He really didn't get a chance to tell me the extent of the injury simply because right now he is speaking with a fire investigator. Now, as you said, the investigators, they are still on scene. And while they're on scene, uh, there is a crew that just arrived arrived here. They're getting ready to uh, board up the place here. Obviously, because this is still uh, this this entire scene is just still under investigation. Now, uh, I will tell you that uh, a, uh, a woman who was at work uh, but rushed to the scene after getting a phone call uh, told me that her husband and three year old son were inside this house when the fire started. Now, according to firefighters, uh, the two were upstairs and heard a loud pop before the fire erupted. An eyewitness who was outside said he saw heavy smoke emanating from the first floor, then heard the man inside yell for help. He said. Seconds later, he saw the father and son jump from the second floor window to escape the blaze. Another witness tells News for Jack she saw the father carrying the little boy to an ambulance uh, that had just pulled up as fire crews were arriving. Now, according to firefighters, flames had reached the second floor, but a closed bedroom door may have bought the father and son some time to escape. That keeps the fire and the smoke away from them and protects them. So, in essence, that really was beneficial to them in this fire. And again, as I said, when we first began, uh, the father has just arrived here. He's over there right now. He's talking to investigators and he tells me that his son had to be taken to a hospital in Gainesville. Another note, uh, we're finding out too that the family cat died in this fire. A friend of the family tells me that uh, the family had, the, the parents had just bought, the, bought a kitten uh, for their son for Christmas. And unfortunately, uh, that cat did not survive the blaze. Of course, as soon as we get more information on this, we're going to post that on our website, newsforjacks.com. And of course, we'll have a lot more on this fire coming up later tonight. Reporting live, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.